Hello. Good evening, everybody. Jó estét mindenkinek. It's a real pleasure to be here. It's an honor. Hogy itt lehetek. I want to thank the organizers for inviting me here to be a part of this wonderful, wonderful day. It's so nice to see everybody coming together to praise the Lord, to recognize what He has done for us, what He is doing for us. Glory be to the Most High God. It's also an honor to be asked to come here and pray for those of our leaders who have been watching us, who have been praying for us and upholding us day and night. And everybody who knows Daddy Gio knows that he has been laboring for us over the years. What an honor it is to be here, to be able to pray to the Almighty God. And I ask that you join me in prayers. I don't know how many people here are Yoruba, but I want to just start with a hymn that I know will resonate also to Daddy Gio in Nigeria. It's a chorus. My voice is not like the ones you've been hearing. So. <laughs> Hosanna, yeah, oh, she, oh, baba, oh, well, oh, yeah, oh, baba, oh, lore, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, 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 Please stand up, please. As Daddy Gio celebrates this special day, his 81st birthday, we wish him happy birthday. We celebrate with him and thank the Almighty for this opportunity to offer up to him our communal prayers for his, for his good health, happiness, and for the continued anointing of the great works of our beloved daddy Enoch Adejare Adeboye. Let us all thank God for Daddy Gio's exemplary and visionary spiritual leadership over us in the redeemed Christian Church of God in Nigeria and throughout the Christian world as he continues to dedicate his life to planting churches all over the world and to winning souls into the kingdom of God. Let us take some Uh, special verses and pray inside us to follow him and to continue to bless him. Isaiah 54, 17 says that no weapon formed against him shall prosper, but in that coming day, no weapon will be turned, that turned against him will succeed. He will su silence every voice that is raised, raised up to accuse him. Let us pray that the good Lord will continue to give him victory over his enemies. Pray for his victory. Pray that, he will con that the good Lord will vindicate him in all his works. Psalm 138.8 says, The Lord will fulfill his purpose for me. Your steadfast love, O Lord, endures forever. Do not forsake the work of your hands. Ephesians 2.10 says, For we are God's handiwork, 
created in Christ Jesus to do good works. Let us pray that the Lord will not forsake the works of his hands in Daddy Gio's life. Pray. Pray that God will not forsake his works in his life. Let us pray that error will be far away from Daddy Gio in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Zephaniah 3.17 says, The Lord your God is with you, the mighty warrior who saves. He will take great delight in you. In his love, he will no longer rebuke you, but will rejoice over you with singing. Let us pray that the Lord will take delight in Daddy Gio, that he will have no cause to rebuke him, but rather that the Lord will be rejoicing over everything he does, over his life and over his works. Let us pray that the good Lord will give Daddy Gio the desire of his heart and make all his plans succeed. Isaiah 46, 4 says, Even to your old age and gray hairs, I am he. I am he who will sustain you. I have made you and I will carry you. I will sustain you and I will rescue you. Thank God for Daddy Gio coming to this good old age. Praise God for his life. Pray that God will continue to carry and bear him and that God will save him. Folytatni fogja az ő munkásságát benne, és megmenti. Mark 16:20 says, Then the disciples went out and preached everywhere, and the Lord worked with them and confirmed his word by the signs that accompanied it. Pray that Dodi Gio's apostolic anointing will continue to flow to the sick. The oppressed, the brokenhearted, and those who need to know the truth about the kingdom of God. That God will use him afresh, even now, and give him a fresh anointing. Pray that the mind of Christ will be strong in him. Pray for his faith and works to remain grounded on the cross and not on his human mind. Pray that the Lord will call him friend. He has already called him friend. Will continue to call him friend. And continue to make himself known to him. Pray that the Lord will perfect his race. And that he will be an everlasting friend of the Most High God. Pray that God will command his angels to guard him and his family as they travel up and down to spread the gospel and draw more people to the kingdom. Pray for his protection that he will be delivered from terror, from the darts of doubt and diseases. The Lord God says that he will call and that we will call on him and he will answer us. Pray that God will be with Daddy Gio in, trouble, in his trouble, that he will deliver him and honor him. May the Lord be their refuge and fortress. Pray that this year, the Lord will give him peace on all sides. In this his special year, God will show him mercy, bless him, and be gracious to him, to his family, to his loved ones, and to all that surround him, even us. And now, let us pray. Numbers 6, 24 to 26 as a benediction. The Lord bless and keep you and Pastor Adeboye. The Lord make his face to shine on you and the Lord be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face towards you, Daddy Gio, and give you peace now and throughout your life. In the mighty name of Jesus, we have prayed. Amen.